Have you ever been on somebody's email list or audience and you get an email that says, oh, there's only one spot left in my coaching program? Or, uh, yeah, it's just this idea of, wow, I'm, I'm getting this email that's probably being sent to thousands of people and they're telling me there's only one or two spots left in the program. How does that make the rest of the people feel who can't get those one or two spots? And I think a lot of marketers don't um, model in their mind what, how does their audience feel when they get that message? And this is what I'm kind of encouraging you in this video to think about, is how are you making your audience feel when they receive your emails? Does each audience member, do most audience members feel served? Or uh, is, is there anxiety being created like, oh, I'm gonna miss out on something? Um, Unfortunately, that's what a lot of marketing is, is, is today, is making us feel anxious if we don't buy something. And I hope that I never make you feel that way. Um, <laughs> and if I do, please let me know so I can, I can adjust. But I, I, I hope that as a marketer, um, I'm always helping you to feel more uh, relief. Uh, I'm helping you to feel more empowered. I'm helping you feel uplifted and inspired instead of anxious or uh, this feeling that, oh God, when is he going to start selling to me? Because I, I'm on people's email lists and audiences and I can kind of tell, I can tell just being in their audience that they're using their content to just at some point sell to me. Um, it, it, it feels like the content is just leading up to the, the you know, leading up to the sale. And I don't know if you felt that way in other people's audiences, but um, think about how that feels to you and turn that around and realize that, oh, I don't want to make my audience feel that way as well. And I think that's what truly authentic and ethical marketing is, is to ask ourselves, how do we want not to be treated and make sure we don't treat our audience that way? So it's often easier to feel when something feels negative and go, oh, I don't want that happening to the person that I'm treating as well. And also similarly, how do we feel when we feel good about someone else marketing to us and how can we emulate that and do the same thing unto others? So I hope that this is helpful. The golden rule has stood the test of time and let's use that golden rule in our business and in our in relationship to others as we build our audience and, and market our business in an authentic, ethical and truly conscious and fulfilling way.